The Southern Nevada DUI strike force was formed in 2018 after a deadly Labor Day weekend that killed 12 people on the roads. Since then, the team has made nearly 4,000 DUI arrests, but just because they're dissolving doesn't mean those arrests will stop. A three year partnership dedicated to stopping DUIs is coming to an end. In 2018, Metro Police teamed up with Nevada Highway Patrol to crack down on impaired drivers. Unfortunately, about 58% of our fatalities involve some sort of impairment. Andrew Bennett with the Nevada Office of Traffic Safety says the strike force is breaking up because of scheduling, staffing, and new focuses. But that doesn't mean catching drivers traveling under the influence isn't a top priority anymore. Las Vegas Metro plans on continuing to have a DUI squad. NHP, every trooper is trained in DUI enforcement and detection. Since 2018, Metro and NHP made nearly 4,000 DUI arrests together, thanks to new skills and techniques brought on by the strike force. Bennett says officers and troopers, once part of the team, can now carry those skills and techniques into their own departments. Mobile roadside phlebotomy, doing the blood draws on scene so we don't have to race that two hours. Um, and again, having those partnerships, those partnerships don't go away tonight. Uh, those will also continue. He says the strike force even just existing was a success. He says it reminded drivers how seriously Southern Nevada law enforcement takes impaired driving. It was a race to 100 arrests, then 1,000, then 2,000, then 3,000. And so that was important for people to understand that if you do choose to get behind the wheel impaired, uh, you will be prosecuted and you will be caught. The Office of Traffic Safety continues to encourage drivers to keep their eyes out for impaired drivers while on the road. They say having more people on the lookout for those driving under the influence will lead to even more DUI arrests. Reporting from NHP, Sophia Paracone, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.